This is a Toshiba laptop, model number PSLD0U00800X. And I wonder if they can add any more letters and numbers onto that. I'm going to show you how to get to all the parts in the back of this computer. And two of the things I really don't care about it, about it. Alright, start now. Okay, the first thing you do on the laptop is you take the battery out. Okay, pop that thing. They got little finger tabs here, and you can lift it up. Get it out. And that's one thing I do like about this computer. Un unlike another one I showed on, on, uh, on YouTube, uh, there was no way to get your finger underneath without pulling a, a screw up or something like that. These all have little finger tabs that you can get under under it. Alright, for the, for the memory, uh, you need to uh, pop the screw. Now there's two screwdrivers you're going to need for this. Actually three. You're going to need a little Phillips, a smaller Phillips, and a flathead screwdriver for this guy. Alright, and uh, you're saying why? <laughs> get, get ready, okay? Here's where the memory chips are. Alright, uh, I pull the levers back on each one to pop a memory chip out. Um, and then uh, pop this back in, clamp down. And take your larger of the Phillips heads and screw that guy down and push. And if it goes, there you go. You're not going to break anything, you just got to get it flat. Okay, I already unscrewed these guys over here. Um, something I want to show, I want to make sure this is in there. All right, this is something I don't like. All right, there is nothing back here holding this hard drive into place. There's no screws holding it down, nothing. The only thing you have is this. Okay, which might be a good design design thing that is in there. Okay, and actually holding the, uh, this back. But there's just something about being secure in a place that, uh, you know, it's wobbling right here. There's movement. And I don't know how well, as far as up and down, this is flat. This is flat right here, so I don't know how well up and down it's holding. So, so anyway, you pull this guy back and the SATA hard drive is out. All right, four screws to take uh, the hard drive out, pop it back in. But Toshiba, you need to have the restore CDs, okay, uh, to uh, load. Uh, another uh, HP, Dell, whatever, uh, outside of a generic uh, installation, um, you, you do need to have uh, the CDs. This guy, um, you're gonna push down, there's a lot of clicking with this until it's level and then screw the two, uh, two screws down. Now, this is, uh, I, I already pulled this screw out because this screw needs a much smaller Phillips head to get to. It looks the same as others, but it, I couldn't get it out without using a smaller one. Now this is, uh, this is something, uh, I don't know why they couldn't just make a pull thing like this uh, for the uh, CD-ROM drive, but now you need a screwdriver. There's a little slot right here. You're going to put that down there and give it a good push this way to get the CD-ROM drive out. All right, so so um, that's why you need the screwdriver. Pop this back in. It clicks into place. Put your screw back in the, into place. Put the battery back in, and you're all set. Okay, just things, some things I wanted to point out on a, on this Toshiba laptop. All right, hope it helps you out. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Tell a friend about it. And uh, maybe you can uh, replace your own hard drive, uh, replace your own battery memory. All right, tell me what you think. Bye.